Hi, I'm Coach Mike McCabe of 101 Kicking, CEO and founder. And today with us we have Rodrigo Blankenship. In college, won the uh, Lou Groza Award for the top kicker in the country and plays in the NFL with the Colts and is now here training, getting ready for the season. And actually, what we're going to work on today is break down all the different segments that we do in kicking, you know, all the way down from using, you know, a, a goalpost drill that we use. We're going to go through using the whole process of uh, using a half round bag that we have. And, and also, you know, working on contact. So that's mainly the main focus that we're, we have here that we're going to work on today. Coach, you got anything to say? Uh, yeah. Again, Rodrigo Blankenship. Been working with Coach McCabe and one-on-one -on -one kicking for a very long time, since around seventh grade. So I've done these drills quite a few times, um, but hopefully we can just demonstrate them for everybody that's going to be watching this video, demonstrate everything properly, and just get everybody to improve their skills in kicking. Okay, so the first drill that we're going to do, uh, as Coach McCabe referred to previously, it's just called an upright drill. Um, it's a variation of the contract drill progression. There's three different progressions or modes that you can do the contact drill in, and this is just the most basic one. If you don't have footballs, if you don't have sticks, if you don't have anything else, and you just have yourself, and you have uprights, or you have a soft surface that can absorb the impact of your foot, then you can do a contact drill like this. So we're gonna go ahead and use uh, this foam pad that's wrapped around the base of the upright for this drill. You're gonna go ahead and pretend as if the foam pad of the upright is the ball, and you're gonna situate yourself properly uh, with respect to your plant foot and the rest of your body position as if you are just about to make contact with the foam pad. The purpose of this drill is, as the name states, to work on contact as if you're making contact with the ball. You want to make sure that you're making contact on the right part of your foot and you want to make sure that you're making contact uh, with, bone. Right, with the metatarsal bone. Um, there's a big bone that connects from your ankle down to your big toe and that's the bone that you want to be making contact with when you hit a football as well as when you practice in this drill. You also want to make sure that when you're making contact that your leg is fully locked out to make sure that you're optimizing your power and your elevation. If you're making contact with the ball and your leg isn't locked out yet or if it's past the point of lockout then you're not going to have an optimal swing in terms of your power and trajectory. So that's why we call it the contact drill because you're working on contact on your foot and contact with respect to your whole leg and lockout. So I'll go ahead and demonstrate and I'll let you guys check it out. 